the updated UI editor in Create offers a host of customization options. This video will give a brief overview of the layout of the UI editor window. On the left-hand side, we have the page hierarchy. This lists the structure of the page, including every individual component on the screen. Here, you can hide and show items, rearrange them by clicking and dragging on the Move icon, and rename them by double-clicking their name. To delete a component, simply select it and press the Delete key. Next, we have our building blocks. These are individual blocks used to create different components within the template itself. You'll find some basic building blocks here, as well as predefined ones like buttons, grids, scrolling text boxes, and confirmation dialogues. To add blocks to the canvas, simply drag and drop them onto the canvas. In the middle, we have the canvas itself. This shows your current template and allows you to interact with and arrange the components. You can drag and drop items here to position them as needed. At the top of the canvas, we have the toolbar with various tools and options. Here, you can show and hide the scene view to prevent having to switch tabs. You can also change the device preview to see what your template looks like on other platforms. We always recommend checking the different previews to make sure your template will look as expected on the different platforms you will be publishing to. On the right-hand side is the Component Properties window. This window allows you to configure the selected component's layout and style properties. Here you can adjust the component's size and position, as well adjusting its visual appearance. Additional properties can be added by pressing the plus button in each section. You can also add actions to UI components. Actions can be applied to any UI component, allowing your end users to navigate through your scenario. That's the basic overview of the UI editor in Create. With these tools, you can build and customize your pages with great flexibility and precision. In the following videos, we will dive deeper into some specific features and how to use them effectively.